a 600 kg young female walrus nicknamed Freya was euthanized by authorities in Norway. She was put down because she was a threat to human security and safety. The five-year-old animal that was first spotted on 17th of July had become a huge favorite of crowds. People had named her Freya after the Norse goddess of beauty and love. Now, if we talk about walruses, they need a lot of rest. Between long naps in the sun, a walrus can sleep up to 20 hours a day. But visitors had been bothering Freya by swimming with her, throwing things at her, posing for photographs with her and sometimes even with their children. Repeated appeals and requests to the public to keep distance from the walrus did not work and moving her was extremely risky. Last week, in fact, an ultimatum had been issued that Freya would have to be put down unless people changed their behaviours. But the warning was not heeded. So the authorities were not left with any option but to euthanise her. They said Freya was in an area that was not natural for her. She had become a threat to human safety and had started chasing people on paddle boats. There are nearly 2,25,000 walruses in the wild. Their natural habitat is the ice sheets and icy arctic waters of Canada, Greenland, Norway, Russia and Alaska. Climate change and melting arctic ice is causing a loss of walrus habitat and some experts believe that Freya might have been trying to find a way north. The last time a walrus was documented this far south in the North Sea was in 2013 and let me tell you, this is not common at all. Experts have condemned the decision to euthanize Freya. Some call the move too hasty and others say that the decision did not take into account the animal's well-being.